Alrighty guys, um, today we are working on the folding knife, which is coming along pretty good. I got the bevel done, um, hole drilled, and whatnot, but we don't have any handle scales. So let me show you what I am thinking might work for some handle scales, just might. So, this aluminum, I'm not totally sure if it's wide enough. I think it is, maybe. Um, I guess I'll need to do some drawing and planning, and then I will get back to you on if it is wide enough or not. Okay, I have deduced that it is not wide enough, so I'm going to try to forge it. Um, well, not really forge it because I don't have any propane, but I'm going to try and hammer it, and it should widen it out and give it some really cool texture, so we're going to attempt to do that. Okay, so you saw I got this out of the Etch and Instant Coffee and it's looking beautiful, but I don't really like the handles, that the handle that much, so I'm going to try to make a better one with this walnut here that I cut from a tree at my grandparents' farm. So we're going to go over to the bandsaw, cut out some pieces, and try and get some handles.
So I've set the table back and that allows me to put these um, like curves on it, I guess, or like 45 degree angles, I think. You can see it there. Oh my gosh, guys, this thing is so cool. Um, it is the first folding knife I've ever made. It's also the coolest folding knife I've ever made. It's super sharp. Um, yeah, this thing's amazing. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe because I put a lot of time into this, like a lot. This is probably like 12 hours total. Uh, maybe even more actually, probably. Um, Anyways, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I love reading you guys' comments, so make sure you leave a comment, and I guess I'll see you in the next one. Bye.